Hi everybody, it's Shanna. I wanted to bring a couple cards that I made to show you. I'm going to go give one of them to my mommy. So I um, wanted to get the video made before I go see her this evening. So um, these are two different stamps from SWALK. They're rubber stamps. Um, and I just think this little girl is just too precious. It actually reminds me of precious moments, really. Um, so they're both five and a half by five and a half inch easel cards and um, I colored this little girl with my Copics um, the, I cut the letters when I the stamp I separated the words and so I positioned them on my um, Fiskars um, that push I guess whatever the stamp press thing and I uh, used some, just some paper that I had in my stash that are like from the single sheets that you can buy. And this uh, purple, I'm not sure where I got it from, but it wasn't like regular cardstock. It's real um, glossy and thick. So, um, so I just colored her up and then put layered her with just a couple different. I don't know, you can see, just kind of angled the two pieces of paper. Then um, down here, this is a sticker, this keyboard, and I actually put three pieces. I cut three different pieces of, um, I want to say, lightweight chipboard. It's like the cover from your paper pads and then popped it up on foam dots so that way the easel had somewhere to hold on against too. And then down here is just a little die that I have for my creative time. Um, it's the fly away sentiments and it came with the die. And then the stamp itself is for my creative time. It's from the this and that um, collection. I was hoping this would cheer my mom up a little bit. She's been a little down in the dumps. So so it just says take it one day at a time then I just added a little swirl here and this is a little crocheted flower and button that I got from Michaels and then the second one um, don't really have a purpose for this one I just really liked the little girl it says after the rain the sun always shines again and this one um, I did layer some purple and yellow I thought that I love those colors together and I don't know if you can see it, but on this was blue paper. I kind of, um, you can see it better right there. I used a first Fisker's texture plate that had raindrops. And I stamped it, I mean I pressed it, and then I um, took uh, Broken China Distress Ink and um, inked it. Well, then I decided that I wanted to make this shiny, so I sprayed some homemade glimmer mist on top of it. So I it, it kind of um, I guess maybe I should have taken the distress ink again because it it kind of washed the distress ink back a little bit because way when it reacted but I still like it it's very shiny and I did actually spritz the whole front panel of this card also uh, this piece with it and um, down here I just used a Martha Stewart punch to get this little border added weave some ribbon in it and stuck a little purple flower that I also again came from Michaels with the button so those are my two little cards um, I really am happy with them I'm gonna probably color some more of those up because I just love this image so thank you so much for watching have a good day bye